Now, you know, in other parts of the military, we call that enhanced interrogation. <laughs> no, 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 you know what it is? It's a test to see if they'll kill each other. Right. That's all it is. That's, <laughs> that's a great but, reality so show. They have to, yes. That is a great yes. reality show. But they have to leave their weapons outside, I right. think, maybe. <laughs> so, Chapia, I have here crew health and performance exploration analog. Wow. Okay. Yeah. And it sounds like something you would put in yogurt. <laughs> like I'm so healthy, I put so much chapia in my yogurt. <laughs> <laughs> so, so where, where did this take place? It took place in a, a hangar on Johnson Space Center in a 3D printed habitat. Wow! So this is in Johnson Space Center in Houston. In Houston, Texas. That's right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So it was 3D printed to simulate maybe what you would do on Mars. You have to print up anything you need. Yeah, you can't carry it there, right? You can't carry it, and you need to use the materials that are possibly present. So obviously regolith, which is those, you know, a soil that is going to be on the Martian surface, is a potential substrate that you could use to actually print something. Um, other options, of course, are but to just to be, But just to know, be clear, regolith, when we think, we, we loosely say Martian soils, but soil has a very strict meaning on Earth, which Mars does not have. So what's the difference between soil and regolith? Well, there's going to be mineral content differences. So Mars is actually made up of the same minerals as the Earth, but it has different components, different proportions. So you're going to have different proportions of minerals present. You're also going to have a lack of moisture because Mars is does have some water in the ice caps and potentially underground, which is pretty exciting. Mm. But it does not actually have water content easily available on the surface the way our soil would have, you know, water content. So, so in therefore, it. it doesn't support a biota in the soil itself. Correct. Okay, yeah. so that's why Mark Watney right. had to get uh, he made poop potatoes. Right. Yeah. He yeah. couldn't just yes. grow it in the in the soils of right because the, isn't the isn't a lot of the soil iron what do you do with that well you can't do a lot with it uh, other than actually build a habitat so you can actually potentially use it to uh create a habitat that might actually be both uh, protective in from environments and also potentially protective from radiation as well so that's something oh, that i think material. One of, that's what, great yeah exactly yeah <laughs>